tend to encourage joint projects in conjunction with the civil, political, and religious society in Lebanon. Local activities vary in nature between one country and another, more precisely between one generation and another. The oldest waves of immigrants to Argentina, Chile, and Uruguay struggle to preserve the Lebanese identity in the hearts and minds of their children. Folkloric groups are formed among the youth to keep them energized and attached to their roots. Scholarships are distributed traditionally in many world cities, reportedly in Canada, USA, Australia, Bolivia, and others. Charitable activities oriented to help the elderly were reported in Los Angeles, California. Lebanese patriotic events are commemorated in almost 23 countries. First and second generation Lebanese constitute the population in these countries. As for the lobbying for Lebanon, it is mostly conducted by groups of Lebanese academics and professionals in Washington, D.C. and New York. As for the rest of the countries, the Lebanese immigrants all get motivated during tragic events occurring in Lebanon. They organize visits to local government officials, march the streets, hit the airwaves, boost their humanitarian activities, and initiate letters to the United Nations, the Vatican's, and all concerned parties. Finally, let us not forget the Lebanese clubs within colleges and universities. Their membership is formed by Lebanese students, a national treasure that should never be ignored or lost. <laughs>